We're going to look at finding the average value of a function. If f is able to be integrated on the closed interval a, b, then the average value, and we're going to call it f of c, is 1 over b minus a times the integral from a to b of f of x dx. If we have our curve here from a to b, there is a certain area underneath the curve. The average value turns out to be the y value, or the f of c, so that the area of this red rectangle is exactly the same as the area of the entire item. Notice the area of a rectangle would be the length here times the width. Now, over here, the entire area is this thing, integral from a to b of f of x, so we divide it by the length. So we're left with the width, which is f of c. So that's the average value on this curve. Let's look at a specific example. For our example here, to find the average value, we're going to take the integral of 3x squared minus 2 from 0 to 2, and we're going to divide it by 1 over b minus a. So that would be 2 minus 0. So we have 1 over 2 times to take the integral. Remember, we take 3 x, we raise the exponent by 1, divide it by 3, minus 2x, and we go from 0 to 2. Remember, we don't need the c value because both terms have it and it canceled out. So we're left with 1 half. We replace this with a 2. So we're left with 2 cubed minus 2 times 2. Minus, we replace it with 0. And in this case, the second term cancels out, but be careful because that does not always happen. So we have two cubes, we have 8 minus 4 minus 0, so we have 1 half times 4, so we wind up with the total average value would in fact be 2.